Here, we got something. All right, turn it on. Come on. There, did you hear it? Gotcha, little sucker. Holy cow, this thing's got some punch to it. Unbelievable. Oh, there, there. Where'd he go? Oh, we got him. Got him right in there. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Unboxing with Scott. Today's video, we got a bug zapper. So let's go ahead, open this up, see what we got, and test it out. I almost feel bad for the bugs. They got no idea what's coming for them. They're going to get electrified. <laughs> All right. Oh, they definitely put a lot of tape on this package. All right, so this is it. So, it looks pretty much like a tennis racket. Obviously, you don't touch this with your hands when this is ready to go. Um, let's see, inside they provide us with a manual. Power cable for charging. I believe that looks to be it. And we got something over here. Man, they tape all this stuff up. My word. I don't think they needed that much tape. Alright, so this is the little stand for it. So you just place it in here and it stands up just like this. So let's go ahead. It does need batteries. So, oh no, it doesn't. Alright, so. <laughs> forgive my mistake. It's rechargeable. That's why you got the charging cable. Sorry guys, I need coffee this morning. I have not had my coffee. So it's rechargeable, you do not need batteries. So this, you press this and this makes the metal live. Um, you have off, on, and on too. Now, when you have on number one, so there's off, on one, and on two. On number two, it's you got a loop, a light in here, and I think it's live already. I'm not sure if you have to press this. We'll check the manual out, but you got little light in here. On number one, there's no light, and you press it to activate it, and then the light comes on when you press it. And of course, you have off again. Once you turn it either on on one or on two, do not touch this part. Don't touch that. Yes, my friends. So when you have it on on one, which is mode number one, you have to press and hold it for the zapper to work and you got to keep holding it. If you put it on number two, it's already live. You don't have to press the button. It's ready to go, ready to zap without even pressing the button. So again, be very careful. You don't want to shock yourself. Um, obviously, you're not going to die. It's not like putting your finger in your outlet, but you're going to get shocked and it's not going to feel good. So keep away from children's, keep away from pets. And when you're using this, make sure to keep your hands away from the metal. All right, guys. So that's what it looks like. Let's go test it. All right, guys, let's go ahead and see if we can get something. So it's going to be a little hard. Uh, so we got it turned on. Let's see if we can. There's a fly. Don't know if we got it. Holy cow, guys, this thing is no joke. There is a, a gnat and I just swung at it and it sparked like crazy. It actually startled me. I was not expecting this. So, man, I wish my camera was rolling. I mean, I'm, I'm serious, guys. I've reviewed other ones of these and they are nothing, not even close to as good as this one. So, I, I hope I find another. Here, we got something. All right, turn it on. Come on. There, did you hear it? Gotcha, little sucker. Holy cow, this thing's got some punch to it. Unbelievable. Oh, there, there. Where'd he go? Oh, we got him. 
Got them right in there. It's still, sh still shocking him because he's still in there. Guys, this one is top notch. So the build quality, it's solid. It doesn't sound like it's gonna break when you shake it. Guys, this is definitely the best electric fly swatter bug killer I've ever reviewed. This definitely blows all the other ones out of the water. 